when I go through your social media, like you constantly speak about wanting a baby. When did I say that? I can show you. Facebook, That's not right? me, y'all. That's not me. On one of your posts, you talked about being cheated on. I was like, you ever experienced that before? I have people making up bad posts, yeah. <laughs> Got your own page about me. This shit is crazy. I stopped playing ball in VA2. My grandmother passed. I was mad far from New York. I just stopped everything. Sure, if she was here, she'd be proud of you, though, right? Because everything you're accomplishing right now. Yeah. I just want you to be something. I'm going to be something. How old were you when she found out you smoked weed? 15, 14. But this was at the time where cops was on you for weed and shit. So she was just telling me, like, just smoke in the house. Just yeah. to be safe. Did you did you smoke with her? We heard them just us in the song before we even made that. If you had to rank off all of y'all on who's the best in the squad, who, who, who would you say? Jay Hound is here. What's good, bro? How you feeling? Sure, bro. I'm chilling, man. Regular day. Chilling. Sure. Congratulations, man. You've been creeping up. Appreciate you. That's a fact. It's well deserved, too, though, right? Because you, you, you've been putting in that work. I was watching a lot of your interviews, and uh, you said, you know, what a lot of people don't know is that y'all been putting out music, like even... I don't know who channel was it uh five channel that y'all were putting the music out? No, nah, it was some it was some other channel we had. It was something else called We the Ops. Yeah, yeah. And some other shit. Yeah. And then now y'all here, man. So like I said, c congratulations, man. But appreciate you, my boy. What uh was it a conscious decision, um, you know, to put out the the series, the the Nikki part one, part two? And if are we getting a part three? If, if if that's what it looking like? I mean, I don't know, man. If that's what people want, I feel like Nikki part two got to get to a certain point mm -hmm. before part three could just get out there. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Nikki part two need a little more, a little more steam. That's a fact. Were you aware that part one was gonna take off the way it did? Nah, that wasn't. That just surprised me. I ain't gonna lie. That wasn't expecting Nikki to be like that. Yeah, she just took off out of nowhere. Cause it was a freestyle, you say, right? Like yeah, you just, it, you didn't I was just it. in the yeah, I was just in the stool. That's that's why it's really crazy. Yeah, cause I feel like the freestyle is the best to do it the way to go. Yeah, cause look, that's my head soul. Was part two written or is that also a freestyle? I'm gonna keep it a buck. The hook, I wrote the hook, and then I just took like my flow from the hook and just made the whole song. Mm -hmm. Everything else wasn't written though, but the hook was written though. I wonder if you like apply like a intense amount of expectation on yourself. Because of how part one turned out, do you feel like, nah, man, yeah. I gotta, I gotta, That's a I fact. gotta double this next yeah, time? Yeah, it gotta like, be something better for me. But do, you, do you feel, feel bad feel like, if you don't reach that number? Like, not even that. If, I mean, nah, because I feel like people say it, nothing is ever gonna be better than the original. So for me, I respect that. Nah, that's a fact. Yeah. So what about um, the the term? Like, break that down for me. I'm not a New Yorker, so I'm not quite familiar what? with some of the terminology. So, what is Nikki? Like, or she getting Nikki? Like, what do you mean when you say <laughs> what that, is that? <laughs> you could. I mean, Nikki got different terms. Like, you could use it in different ways. It could mean freaky. It could mean sneaky. It's just without an S. Oh, okay. So you, so you're just shit. putting it out there for different interpretations. Yeah, it could mean different shit. I ain't gonna lie. Nikki, for me, sneaky, freaky. It's different terms. Because <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I'm, I'm watching. Uh, I read the comments too, and you know, they were people were saying exactly what you're saying. But like, I'm trying to figure it out. I'm like, what is, is Nikki like? From my interpretation, I thought you meant like freak. Like, you know, she getting freaky. My uh, could mean that. It's just all the different. Nah. Oh, she getting Nikki. What you fuck? Nah, I haven't even used the. It should be on the bottom, on the side or something. <laughs> Nah, All right, so Nikki, your definition, freaky. That's it. It's basically freaky or or sneaky type shit. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now it makes sense. Some of the lyrics make sense when you break it down like that. Uh, you're 19, right? Yeah. 19 right now. Uh, I learned that you lost your virginity at 15. <laughs> <laughs> that never said that. 
But you did though, right? I don't, I don't recall saying that. <laughs> but is it true or not? I never said that. I don't know. I, like, I mean, I don't know where you heard that from, gay. Okay? <laughs> but I'm asking you, like, was he nah. 15 when you lost your virginity? Nah. How old, how old were you when you lost your virginity? I'm, the reason why I'm asking that because the song sounded <laughs> freaky as hell. So I'm like, this kid talk. You talk freaky, so I'm like, <laughs> bro. I was like 14, 14, oh, same 13. Thing. <laughs> yeah, around there, like around eighth around grade, it. after eighth grade. So around there, 13, 14. Yeah, it was right before 15. It was right before 15. Okay, so it was, it was under 15. The, the reason why I'm asking that is like, is that like the the culture in New York? Where I don't know that what age? that is. That's me. <laughs> That's what you're doing <laughs> at, at 2, 14, 15. That's a fact. <laughs> So, so let me ask you this then, like, what, what's, what's your mindset like? Um, I, I remember, I don't, I don't know if you remember this, but when I go through your social media, like, you constantly speak about wanting a baby. Like, is that, do, do you want a baby? When did I say that? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> no, what? I, I never said that on social media again. Uh, are you sure? I can That's pull it up. me. I can show you. You're going to have to. <laughs> I'm going to show you after the interview, but. I bet, but I ain't That's not lie. a thing. You never had That's no baby not fever? On my to do list. But you right. had baby fever. I'm, I'm, That's I'm, a fact. My little brother gave me baby fever, but I'm chilling. Yeah. No, I ain't doing that, though. I'm chilling. I don't need a baby right now. That's why I was like, he's what nineteen at the time you was you was making this post. I'm like, he's young as hell. Why are you having baby fever? Well, bro, why you keep saying I made a post? <laughs> I promise you, what post, though, bro? I'm gonna I'm I'm show you. I'm gonna show you. Yeah, that's a fact, bro. It's on your Facebook. You got Facebook. Nah, Facebook is crazy. <laughs> yeah, it's on I your don't Facebook. use Facebook. You you got a Facebook? That's not right? me, y'all. That's not me. That's not you. On I Facebook? didn't make that. Wow, sure who created the Facebook? I didn't. This I is don't interesting. I like this. I have a Facebook page. I don't use it. But you used to be active on it, right? Years ago. Yeah, this is like last year. <laughs> no, nah, yes. you gotta stop. Bro. Let's... <laughs> Jay, I can pull up. All right, bro. <laughs> after the interview, I'm That's gonna pull up. That's not me, y'all. Like I said, be a JM himself. <laughs> I'm gonna pull up after the interview for you. So, okay, that's good. I'm glad you don't have. You don't have baby fever. Okay, so I can't really ask you a lot of the questions that I had based off that because on one of your <laughs> posts you talked about being cheated on. I was like, have you ever experienced that before? Like, you ever got cheated on? Yo, I'm PV making up mad posts. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not, Jay. I'm not. You got your own page about me. This shit is crazy. <laughs> you making up mad posts. I'm just trying to remember. Like, yo, I'll be that fry. Like, Jay, I'm not. I I'm made those posts. Yes, I'm, I'm not. show you. I'll show you after the interview. I'll show I'll you after the interview. I'll be trolling him. Oh, you just be trolling? Wow. <laughs> so you never got cheated on before? Nah. Okay. Have you cheated on someone before? Nah. Okay. <laughs> I, I mean, that's good. I'm glad. That's a, that's that's a thing that that uh, you working on. Like you, you you're a faithful man. But I'm glad that you say this page is made up. I'm gonna show you after the interview where I got the information from. So it's not like I'm just making it up. But you did. Or somebody posing as you did uh, uh, post these information out. But uh, to pivot real quick, I, I, I really admire your beat selection, man. Like, wh you. Wh what's your process like when you're choosing beats? I don't even know. Like, shit just be catching my ear. Mm -hmm. I could hear a beat that'll catch my ear, and then it'll be like another beat that people might say it sound the same, but I'd be like, nah, this shit regular. Yeah. Our producer just be giving me beats, and I'd be like, nah. It'll be one in the round. I'd be like, nah, that shit crazy. Do you have one specific producer that you work with, or do yeah, you I got switch an house producer. My son produced by Double M. That's my house that, producer. Yeah. That's my man right there. That's my son. My son really nice. Me and my son get crafty. I ain't gonna lie. Are y'all together when he's producing? So you kind of nah, know what I you want. Nah, I just tell him. He know. He know what to do. Like he know what I want already. He know what's gonna be a hit. He know what's the sweeper sound. Mm -hmm. Give me those beats, and I just go and do it. Yeah. Nikki, Nikki part one, part two, those is his. Wow. Insta. Yeah, yeah. All of those, one mic, those, that's his. One mic is his too? It's a fact. Wow. That sound really nice, I ain't gonna lie. Nah, I got another dollar coming out too called Sweeper Story. Is that just, just you? Yeah, my dollar. What's it about? It's a Sweeper Story. Obviously, I mean, with the name, is it just you revealing like your, your, your story and stuff? No. So what it was the what's the context? It's just about 
the streets and us yeah like the sweet birds in the streets it's a fact and my son produced by double and made that too mm -hmm. Yo, those yeah, are the two guys that you work with just produced by double m that's one person oh the same person okay I, I i wanted to ask you but the way you said the page that i brought up isn't you so now i'm like skeptical to ask you if this is this actually happening like is um what happened bro? I, it said you know your grandmother passed away is yeah, that that's a fact that's true yeah so like what what was that like processing that for me that was it difficult when she when she was gone because i know she meant a lot to you right yeah so how, how was that how did you deal with that i wasn't even living here i was living in va when i haven't wow I think left i left and came back you know what i mean i didn't want to deal with school or nothing out there mm -hmm. i left that shit came back why were you in va i was chilling out there i was living out there for a little bit Me like how, how long were you out there for like a year and a half no longer than that yeah i was chilling out there who you out there with mom dad my pops pops it's a fact and then you you moved to to the upper west side yeah nah but i've been from the upper west side i've been lived there i moved from there to va okay i always had a crib there though so why why'd you move to to va was it just like a behavioral thing like you was just bad and they sent you out there nah i wanted to go out there i do wonder like with you know your grandmother passing like how, how much does that make you appreciate your mom even more OD, because for me, she's the youngest out of my grandmother kids. Mm -hmm. And she, for me, and she got kids too, so. And she's still around, she's still doing her thing. Yeah. So it make me appreciate her more. Yeah. And I know, know you love your mom too, like that. Yeah, that's you, a fact. You, yeah. It's my heart. Yeah. How, how is she with, with, with the new popularity that you're gaining? Does she like it? She like it for you? Yeah. She want me to be bigger. How would you mean? Like she, she, she like what i'm doing she okay with it she supports what i do yeah but she listens to the music though that's, that's a different a fact. story she does she sings my lyrics to me <laughs> oh okay thanks sir how, how old were you when she found out you smoke weed like 15 14. was she was she was she mad <laughs> nah she was yeah she was tight at first but then it was like it's not harming me so she was chilling mm -hmm. not getting me in no trouble so yeah she got okay with it and then she was just like she was like i right, just pops. but this was at the time where cops was on you for weed and shit so she was just telling me like just smoke in the house just yeah. to be safe i mean so she was okay with it if i smoke why not just smoke in the crib where i'm safe did you did you smoke with her like was she a smoker no <laughs> my mother is not smoking me okay what, what about your pops? I know you say your mom listens to music. Your pops, does he listen to your music? I don't even know. So you don't keep a communication with him? I don't even know. Damn. Do you want to? Do you want to keep a communication with pops? Like, do you want to talk I to? I do. Him? That's my son. I don't care though. He don't. I don't talk to him about my music. I don't. I barely talk to him. I talk to him once in a while. Yeah. That's my son. Though. I, the way you said it, it seemed like you don't even have a relationship with him. You nah, know, yeah, that's I don't my son. I just really talk to him. I don't need to. I mean, he chilling. Yeah. I'm chilling. I live with my mom. I don't need to talk to nobody outside of my box. Mm. I, I respect that, man. I also know you was nice, man. I know you was nice at bar, right? So far. Yeah. You was, you was supposed to go to what? The A? To who? <laughs> or am I, am I wrong about that? <laughs> I don't know, bro. <laughs> Am I wrong about that? Nah, I ain't get that far, bro. But it was going to happen, though. You had dreams of going that I far, had right? dreams about it. I don't know if it was going to happen. Yeah. It didn't get too far. What, what do you think was that uh, that thing that kind of took you away from that? I stopped playing ball in VA2. Mm -hmm. When my grandmother passed. Oh, wow. It's a fact. Why? Like, what, what was the reasoning behind, like, stopping? Because everything just stopped. I just stopped everything. Yeah. I was mad far from New York. I just stopped everything. I like, just fuck everything. Yeah. You mean? Damn. So that, it all. so that your your grandmother passing kind of made you stop everything in the life that you were living in VA and just was like, yo, <laughs> yeah, I'm moving. Yeah, shit blew my... Man. Word. Man. I'm sure if she was here, she'd be proud of you though, right? Because everything you're accomplishing right now. Yeah. That's all she ever wanted for you. That's all parents, grandmothers, grandparents. Used to be that's something. all something. I yeah. just want you to be something. Yeah. I'm going to be something. And you a bright kid, too. Like, it's not like you dumb. You smart. Yeah. So, it's like, either you remember 
who and or make something it something productive something productive fact. you know what i mean instead of the streets that's all they can hope for you but um let me so there is there's a record i want to get to and i need your full attention for this man like um i want to talk about a couple of things real quick because these are some of the things that i noticed y'all haven't really brought any answer to and people are very curious about it uh one of them being um the sub side k record that y'all put out right mm -hmm. um that's what kind of got things bubbling right if i'm not mistaken Mm -hmm. The Sweepers are the new group of rappers from the Upper West Side who arrive into the drill scene at what seems like the perfect time because people were looking for something new. It seemed like the record took off, the Seth Side K record, which is also a record that included this at the Seth Side guys. Guys include K Flock, Dougie B, Thunder Blue, and, and more. The guys from Seth Side seems to think that the diss came out of nowhere as of many people as of the fans and other drill commentators as you saw in the clip from the tg flocka interview according to him the sweepers dissed the sad side guys randomly and everything escalated at this point i can't confirm nor deny who initiated the beef i just know from what i know which is sad side k record kind of started the sweepers versus the sap side but please educate me i would love to be educated leave your thoughts in the comments and let me know how this thing escalated mm -hmm. um first off you're from upper west side harlem or however you want to classify it. i know y'all don't like to say harlem but how does how does uh these these cats from harlem come together and put together a record like sap side k when those are people from, from the, the Upper West Side. Or Upper West Side. How, how does that even, how do y'all even come together and put a, together a record for people from the Bronx? Just how anybody else come together and make a record about people from other boroughs. Like, I heard Brooklyn people, just Bronx people. Did they, I'm saying like, did they have, were there any initial relationship between y'all? Like, did they ever send something to y'all? Like, like, what made y'all want to put together that record? Because something got us angry. A lot of politics. Mm -hmm. A lot of talking and stuff. You know I mean? I don't want to get into that though. Yeah. The record is already out. No, the record is out. But I, I think a lot of people are curious because they're like, like a, a lot of the comments that I read, and, and, and especially like people in the drill community that I talk to personally that are um, well known, they have, they have like, they're curious about you know the records out they're curious about like who initiated things one because there's no no one knows that right because y'all have never spoken on it and they're also curious about like uh some of the comments they make is <coughs> were, were their strategy to just get hot dissing doa and people from Seth side we heard them diss us in the song. Hold on, speak speaking to the mic. We heard them diss us in the song before we even made that. That it wasn't a song that was dropped. We just heard it. Yeah. So the the reason that. why I asked that is because you know I was watching TG interview, yeah. and he said that's not true. He tried. So where, where he how it started? What he said? He's from his understanding is y'all put out Seth Side K out of nowhere and out like, of nowhere like, and that's listen. that's what he said and then everything just escalated from there. That's what he said. Reason why I did that song, really, because niggas is talking on Daz, bro. Why y'all talking on Daz, bro? I don't even know where it came from, nigga. The first song I heard was Seth Side K. I'm like, what the? Yeah. Am I going to lie? They came out with a new sound, bro. So so let me ask you this then. What was y'all reaction when y'all heard uh, Everybody Swept? I didn't even hear that shit. You I didn't listen to it? I'm sure it came across your desk. I heard it a snippet to. of it. Yeah. Uh, the snippet I heard was with some weird shit. And he took bro's float. That's all I heard though. I didn't hear nothing after that. That's bad time. Yeah. I'm not joking. That's all y'all said on um on Adam Twenty Two. Y'all said um like why take his 
his flow like why not do yeah. it on another beat or something like that like yeah, i don't get sweet. but he from his side of the story what he was saying is the reason why he did it is because he was trying to show y'all that he can take the flow and do it better than y'all i don't i don't that's cool yeah but you see the thing is how he could take our flow and try to make it better mm -hmm. but nobody could do that with him you see how we got our own flow he did give y'all credit for that. He, don't. he did give y'all credit for that. He did say so that's y'all created your own lane for yourself. I don't want to even speak on TG Quippy anymore. Yeah, I will give y'all props for that, and I will bring that up because he did give y'all props for that. He said y'all created your own lane. Like Joel was missing something, and y'all were the was thing the that Joel that was missing. Yes. Yeah. That's that's why it's kind of it's kind of weird right now because everyone's waiting for that thing to evolve Joel. And then y'all came and kind of fit that mode that was missing, I guess. And then now it seems like everyone else is kind of, everyone now is waiting for more of that to happen. All right, so if we stop here for a second, I just want to highlight that during the interview with P Film, TG Flocker mentioned that Drill was missing something, which I think we all can agree on because when a lot of the rappers that got locked up, the artists that I listed before, the K Flock, Uggy B, even though he's out right now, but the K Flock, the D thing, when a lot of those rappers got locked up, a lot of the sound that was helping to push the drill music was kind of gone and so a lot of people was repeating those same sound instead of coming out and generating their own fast forward we have a new group with s.go j hound nazi and j5 collectively known as the sweepers from the upper west side who arrive into the drill scene at what seems like the perfect time like i said when people were yarning for new things the record that took off for them set side k which is also the record that they were taking shots at the set side guys so people are curious if the new music and the new sound is what got them hot or is it because what the subject matter was about but we can discuss furthermore in the comment section let me know your thoughts as you resume back to the interview i don't even know if that's even possible like for another thing to come and evolve drill like because i think y'all run is still it's still it's still existing right now so there's no way possible for i don't know i don't know maybe i'm, I'm speaking too soon could they could they, like do you think do you see another another thing coming that changed i don't drill? know i can't predict the future yeah because people ain't see this coming they yeah. didn't think it could be another because eh, jersey is right there right it, not not to compare y'all to jersey didn't, drill but 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 they didn't put the twist I mean, to it like y'all yeah, did yeah, like, yeah. no I, I get it but it's still you, you can still see that similarity and then though. they gave jersey its own shit it's on though I'm, all i'm saying that it was bound to come over at some point yeah because there's it's so close by and i feel like a lot of the jersey artists co collab with some of the new york artists anyway so it was bound to happen for a new york artists to kind of adapt to that sound um and i think y'all just i don't know regardless man y'all special and y'all took it to another level that mm -hmm. I, people haven't seen before so that's dope i'm just skeptical about whether there's going to be another thing that's gonna come and evolve the genre i don't no, know we gotta see man yeah we're not going nowhere though <laughs> gangster yeah i don't know though just gotta see okay um another person i want to i want to ask you about and you don't have you don't even have to speak on it if you don't but i know he he throws shots at you a lot um block work like what where did the interaction or initial conversation with block work even start from because in his, in his last song i just um i think the last song that he had directed to you he was like i can't wait till i run into something like that jay hound or something like that i, I might be i ain't even hear that i might be effing up the line a little bit but i don't even know he so he just came out of nowhere and just, and just <laughs> threw shots at you yeah he thinks he's from the hill i mean i, mean, I guess yeah well, that's probably why he think it what he thinks he's from the hill i mean i guess he's from the hill they jack him that's probably why he does I, I don't i don't think they claim him though right i don't know i don't know why he doesn't us and he's not even from up there i don't know he's weird uh, yeah I, I have a conversation with black work in a couple of weeks so we might talk about it but i was just curious because when i when i saw that i'm like 
I mean, I saw you responded once, right? I said something about Blockwork. Didn't you? Or no. am I bugging? Yeah, you bugging. Who did you? Did you say something about Blackwork? I don't need to mention him. No, I don't think you said something about Blackwork. Yeah, nah, I ain't saying nothing. So how? So where did it come from then? It just came out of nowhere. Like he I told you, he's weird. Wow. So he just felt like he had to put on the, the... cloud chasing. Mm. Cloud chases. Cloud chase. Yeah. See. I mean, is that a fair? Is, is that fair, dog? Because people they say the same thing about y'all, dog. So is that fair? Because they because they said y'all came at we DOA have for no own, reason. We got our own reasons, and if he has his own reason, then he got his own reason. You gotta okay. ask him for me. That's fair. That's fair. Until then, yeah. Cloud chasing. Until we know what the reason is. Until he tells the world, for me, whatever his reason is. Your comment about um, y'all being the best group in in New York. You, you believe that? that? You said you said you you said sweepers and four one are the best group in New York. Biggest so like, group in the city right now. Like, you got that name, man. Talk, on, man. Talk, talk, I really feel like you got that name right now, bro. Nobody. There's no group. I'm not even talking about individually. To like, there's no group right now being talked about like us except for like forty one. They doing anything like, personally? Yeah. Or whatever. What? There's no other group being talked about. Mm, do, 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 do you feel? Do y'all feel like? If, was there like mo like motivational like some type of momentum watching for one and thinking like yo like yo we can beat that we can do that did, nah because we there was no groups besides because it was just for one thing yeah yo. it was just dumb like that's so what I'm saying like and we wasn't even looking at them as like not saying competition yeah because it's not always competition like you could look at somebody and be like oh right, motivation yeah but nah not even not even also funny shit like we that wasn't looking at them like, looking at them like motivation competition nothing. They just doing their own thing. We was already trying to go up. Yeah. Before they even came out, I mean, we was already trying to be. Politics aside, would y'all would y'all do something together? I feel like we the only group. Oh, will we do something together? Yeah, I think that I would know. be huge. I don't know. Probably. I don't think it was ever talked about. Yeah. It's no problem doing it. So I don't know. The reason why I asked that, I think, on the Adam Twenty Two interview, um, now I said. Um, if it comes to business, y'all are open to business. That's a fact. You know, politics aside, and y'all are open to, to doing business. So that's why I asked that. If 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 that if that opportunity was presented, would y'all be open to it? Nah, yeah, we'd probably take it for me. Yeah. That'd be a good swim. That'd be that'd be huge, man. Sweepers and four one. That'd be huge. That'd be huge. Yeah. I'm checking out. All right, man. Did I miss anything? Like what what else what else are you working on? What else you want to share that, that you got coming? Um, sweeper story coming soon. Dolo video. Yeah. Right now, Shaba always just drop live performance out for me. I said right now. So the UK said right. That dropped too, like yeah. last week. That shit was hard. Appreciate you, gang. That shit was hard. The producer they, right there too. You heard produced by Double M. Oh, that's what you talking about. Yeah. Oh yeah, what's good? What's good, that's bro? That's my son right there. Yeah. So he. In house, in house for sure. Cause he yeah, right that's here. That's my man. He's right there. <laughs> wow. Okay. That's him behind all that. All right. Don't switch over him now. <laughs> that's my man. He got all the hits. Yeah. All right. Um. I want. I want to close it out, but I just. I want. I want to. I want to start some beef within the camp real quick. <laughs> so, if you had to rank off all of y'all on who's the best in the squad, who who would you say? I don't have an order for us. Mm. We all nice. Yeah. I mean, there's no order. Can I tell you what the people are saying? Go ahead. They take. They say you. They say you. You number one. They say dot number two. Uh, they say uh, five number three, and Nazi number four. You will say that, but then there could be another person that tell you Nas number one. Yeah. Five number two. I mean, I'm not saying I agree with that order. I'm just saying that's, that's, that's what so they're I saying. I can't put order, but that's people opinion. People opinion matter for me. I'm that's sure you they, see you see that though, right? If, I saw if I'm seeing these things, you're paying. I saw it before. Them. Yeah. But for me, that just don't mean nothing either. Yeah, and you don't see no order within y'all. You nah, just think y'all all we all different. We all sound different. We all nice. It's a fact. I'm just messing with you, man. I know. <laughs> nah, Jay. I, I, I appreciate my, my you. My brothers. They, they're gonna kill me. Last interview we did, they killed me. For, they 
get, I don't know if y'all read the YouTube comments. They kill me. Yo. What happened? <laughs> the last interview we did. What they were saying. With all of us. Oh, my God. I'll show you uh, off camera. But they were like, um, they were like, um, I'm an FBI ace. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Yeah, the question like, would be yeah, crazy. Yeah, they call me FBI. They was like, how he know? Somebody said, how does he know all these things about them? And then somebody commented, and they were like, uh, he's an interviewer. He's supposed to know things. <laughs> and they were like, nah, he's an agent or something like that. But, nah, I appreciate you, Jay, for, for chopping it up with me. That's your camera right there. Just let them know, you know, where to follow you and all. GPGJJ underscore Instagram. Sweepers and T on YouTube. Jay Ham. That's me. Yes, man. Thank you again. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you for having me. Peace.